Everything that robot is supposed to do, you have to figure out how to do it, and you have to make the parts do the thing that, that it's going to do, right? You have to have control over every part of this. The amazing thing about these bio robots is that they already do all kinds of things on their own. They're very competent. The individual cells are competent. The, ro the whole robot can do certain things. And so now the name of the game is, can we figure out how to, um, how to manage it, how to manage those relationships between the cells and their environment? This technology, which is really right at the intersection of, uh, of, of, of machine learning and artificial intelligence, of the plasticity of, of uh, evolved organisms, of us trying to use the machine learning to understand how do we get these cells to do something that they wouldn't normally do, this really blurs the line between robotics and biology because we have a degree of control over these, and that's what, that's what the, the, the machine learning part of this project was. But there's also a tons of novelty here that emerges from the biology itself that we did not directly micromanage or, or program in. Mm -hmm.